Yes. Silver is here with me. Good. He's going to get us into the capsule. This one here. I understand. Sapphire. Silver. I shall have According to, to Silver, this is the governing one, the main one. This is where the power source lies. Silver is right, of course. He always is. Tell me more about the crew of the second capsule. All irregularities will be handled by the forces controlling each dimension. Transuranic heavy elements may not be used where there is life. Medium atomic weights are available. Gold, lead, copper, jet, diamond, radium, sapphire, silver and steel. Sapphire and steel have been assigned. Tell me more about the crew of the second capsule. Come with me. Well, how can I? Just follow my voice. I'll talk to you around the place. But it's a different... No, it's the same. It's the same plan, the same layout. Just step into your hallway. How long? Oh, soon. Very soon. As long as you're back in here and she's back in her communications room in, um, four minutes. And 32 seconds. Uh, quite a work of art, isn't it? Hmm? But I suppose you'll prefer something a little less decorative. Hmm? Something more coldly efficient. Are you through the door? Yes. This is the downstairs hallway of a farmhouse. Now turn right and follow the corridor around. This capsule is disguised as just one floor of a farmhouse. None of the windows or entrance doors are functional. Everything is sealed. There's no way in or out. The sun will have set in an hour or so here. What about there? The same. It wasn't an invasion force after all. Well, if it was, this crew wasn't a part of it. And what do you suppose they were doing? You were part of a survey team. And what were they surveying? I don't know, something very harmless. The survival of the family structure into the 20th century or something like that. Only it turned out to be far from harmless. Sapphire? Sorry. Now there's something very strange just here. What was once glass or glass ornaments has been turned into silicon dioxide, sodium carbonate and calcium oxide. Sand, soda, ash and lime. Yes, the glass has reverted to its original silicate state. Yes. In a few seconds, we're going into that main capsule. 
We could be too late again. Nevertheless, we're going in. There's still the time force, that crystal to be dealt with. Yes. Go back to the communications room right now. There must be a screen in there. Some kind of a screen. Yes. Is it activated? Yes, it is. Then go to that screen, stand by it and wait. Because we'll all be going in together, all three of us, at the same time. Yes, dear. I'm ready, Steele. I'm ready to go in. Now down just a little bit more. Perfect. Steele? Tell her to stay close to the screen. You tell her. Oh, yes, why not? Stay close to the screen, Sapphire. Wait, something's changed. What do you mean, changed? Well, do you remember the last time we were on the roof? Yes. And I said I sensed the child was gone, that it was no longer in there. I remember that, yes. Well, now the two adults seem to have gone. And the child? It's still not there. It's still not in there. Well, who is in there? The third one. The other adult. That's all. That's the only person left in the capsule. What about the power source? The, the crystal? Nothing. It's as if it's dead. I could always try to... No! Whatever you do, don't make contact with it again. Are you ready? Yes, dear. Because I think I know what it might be trying to do. Right. It had better be quick. Oh, it'll be quick. Because if it catches us halfway... It wouldn't need to do that. What? All it has to do is to switch off that screen. How would you like to be transported 1,500 years into the future? Hmm? Tell Sapphire it's now. Now, Sapphire!
You both came through there? Yes. What happened? Just look at this place. I said, what happened? We got in. That's what happened. There was a defensive time field, a sort of vacuum. And that? Was it? This place is amazing. Who set up this time field? Whoever made the capsule. It was built in, some sort of security device. The time source wasn't involved. Well, it must have had something to do with it. That would have been part of its job. Sensory control. It's all very sophisticated. Don't touch anything. Oh, absolutely not. You know, this must be one hell of a communications room. Hmm. I said, don't touch anything. Not in here. What is it, Steele? Well, if that time source was involved with the defensive field... It's bound to be. It's involved with everything. Right, it brought the capsules here. Well, it's instrumental in bringing them. But what would it have used to create that field? It would have been space, wouldn't it? No. Uh, no. Static space. So it could have left us out there in time and space? Yes, yes, it could have left us there indefinitely if it wanted to. And why didn't it? It's been fighting us ever since we got here, trying to prevent us from getting in. Why not this time? When it would have had the advantage. Yes. Do we go back the same way? There's no other way. Now, there's a comforting thought. Sapphire. I, I don't quite understand. It hasn't been burned and it hasn't been cut. Well, what has happened to it? It's lost its... No. It's never achieved its molecular structure. In other words, this part of the door has never existed. Zinc carbonate, pyrites of copper, and cellular tissue, plant tissue, the primary states of brass and wood. Do you mean something, someone did that? Yes. And whoever it was, they were standing here. They were standing right here. When? Not long before we arrived. So where are they now? Somewhere. We'd better locate it first. Look, I get you in, I get you out. I'm a technician, I'm not an explorer. You want to wait here? Alone? No. Wait. This isn't. No bricks, no plasterwork. Is it the same as the outside wall? Yes. It's synthetic material. What about the people? There's still only one. Could have been wrong. Wrong? Yes, about the crew members. I could easily have been wrong. My calculations could have... No. You were right the first time. I told you. Sealed. There was a child in here. How long ago? A few hours. And now? Same sort of material as the outside wall. Some kind of, um, metal? Look. Good heavens, it's all over the place. Now, this had happened in the other capsule. What is it? You mean, what was it? All right, what was it? Glass. When? A few hours ago. You mean 
like this. Nothing? No. Nobody. Not a soul. And where have they gone? However... There is something here. Some kind of machine. The time source? No, no, not that kind of power. It's some sort of recording device. Or a transmitter. Something like that. Transmitting to where? Back to their base control, I suppose. To a base control that's 1,500 years in the future? Yes. Now, what sort of signal would they need for that? Is it working now? No, no, it needs to be triggered. I could get it to operate. I'm sure you could. I'm sure you could cause a fair amount of panic in the process. Panic? Back at base. I mean, what's the first thing they might do if they heard strange voices coming over the wires? <laughs> Let's recall the capsule. Do you think you could get us off in time? No. Steel. It's in here, in this room. It can't be. It? Yes. Something. Someone. You stay there. Oh. Up there? On that level? Yes. Where? There, there, there. Come back down here, Safa. Sapphire. Where are the others? Where are the others? Others? The woman and the child. Where are they? There are no others. Do you know who we are? Yes. And are you not surprised to find us in here? Yes. Sapphire. I can't do an analysis. Not from here. I need to be closer to him. No. Tell us about your project. Project? 
Yes, your reason for being here. I mean, you're part of a, a team, aren't you? Part of a survey team on a survey into the past. Yes. Prepare. Experimental project ES stroke five stroke triple seven. Urban examination and observation. All references according to old time and old calendar. Fine. Now, where are the others? The other members of your team. Where are they? There are no others. There's only me. Well, if that represents the future... He doesn't. But he does steal. In a way, he does. How can that possibly represent the future? Know. It's some kind of future. I'm just not sure. His own future? He represents his own future? It's time. It's to do with time. That's a machine. No. And I can fix a no, machine. No, any, don't interrupt, machine. Silver. Oh, come on, now, Steele. You've tried talking to that thing, and what sort of answers have you had? It's human. It can't be. Leave it to Sapphire. Let her work it out. Humans give answers. Proper answers. Machines don't. I mean, we're risking our lives in this contraption. It is trying... human. No, Sapphire. Keep clear. But there's something wrong. It's at the beginning. It doesn't know anything. It doesn't sense anything. See, I told you! It's a machine! No. It has no knowledge. But it has a need. It depends on things. What things? Warmth. And sleep. It needs sleep and warmth and food and love steel it's a baby a baby yes how old is it 10 12 weeks So I'm afraid you've both fallen into the trap of attributing human characteristics to a simple flexible casing and a handful of circuits. They can easily program a machine to have a, a child's mind, a child's Why mind. would they do that? I don't know why, but I can soon find out. I'll open it up. No. You keep away from it. Look, steel, 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 steel. I am the technician. And there's no machine, past, present, or future that I cannot handle. 